Hey Water Signs, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, welcome everyone to my channel. This is going to be your weekly reading and we are going to be looking at you and your person, so you versus them and what's going on subconsciously and anything we can learn about your love situation. So thank you everyone for being here, liking, sharing, subscribing and also signing up to membership. It does mean the world to me, so thank you so much for doing that. Let's kick off with your energy Water Signs and see what's coming up Um what's coming up around you it's your overall energy in terms of the subconscious okay subconscious energy you've got the queen of swords water signs okay this is air energy this is all about your thought and your mentality now the queen of swords often rules gemini so gemini is all about communication so there's something that you're sort of working your way up to say um, you've been thinking about it for quite some time. It's taking up a lot of your thoughts. Whoever this person is, they're on your mind a lot. Or there's a reason why they're on their mind, on, on your mind a lot. So Gemini energy is the overthinking energy. So you're overthinking or you're anxious about a certain situation. I also feel like, um, communication is coming in around you. Okay. This could also be on a subconscious level guys. So this could be that you and your person are thinking about each other at the same time. Um, or it could be that there's this opening up that's happening here through communication. So that's powerful to see. I feel like that's 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 big for you, um, what a sign. So you've got that sort of um, dominating your spread here. Now, you also have the two of pentacles underneath, the hanged man and the death card. Okay. The death card is a Scorpio. Some of you want to go back to a Scorpio. Or you keep thinking about a Scorpio. This is things that were unsaid, that were hidden, that you want to reveal to your person and you haven't had the chance to do it yet. Something you may be feeling bad about. Okay, the hangman, you might have done something that maybe wasn't something you were proud of. Water signs. Um, but you might have done something here and this is coming up in the cards. If it's not, it could be the past. I feel like the death card is telling me you're either thinking about ending a situation with a person or you're thinking about giving things another chance with the past, like a past love, a past flame. You know, maybe you weren't necessarily in a relationship with this person, but you want to give things another go because the past is coming up around you. And it's almost like you're overthinking the past, looking at past mistakes. I want to say mistakes because the hangman makes mistakes, okay? That's how he got in this position in the first place. So water signs, what's happening here is that you're assessing the situation of how you got to a, how you got where you are, how you got to a certain level and what you did to get there. So you're, you're maybe punishing yourself. The hangman, the death card, you could be... You could be punishing yourself for what you did wrong in a situation or for what you could have done different. Not so much regrets though, water signs, I don't think. Knight of Swords telling, telling me something happened very fast or something is happening very fast and like you, you you can't really keep up with it because you don't you don't know where to take it from there, right? It's more air energy. So this is again your mind going in overdrive. You're having a lot of thoughts and I wouldn't be surprised if some of you water signs end up doing something very crazy very sporadic, um, very spur of the moment. You may even surprise yourself with what you do here. Uh, okay, there could also be something that you want to tell or you want to confess to someone. Because that open communication is here, maybe you've been thinking about it for quite some time. Could be a long distance person, someone that's foreign. Okay, we've got the ship, the shore. So um, it could be someone that is further away, especially if some of you have online connections or long distance loves. Maybe this is what's coming up. Not necessarily, but I feel like you've been in two minds and you've been back and forth about confessing something. You either want to confess about your past, confess about something you did, or there is an intention here that you want to get back with someone from the past. It's lingering around you. Let's look at your person. Okay, card underneath, your person has the four of wands. This is the marriage card, the relationship card. So, okay, this person may not know about what you've done. 
they might be oblivious to it with the four of wands they're feeling pretty good about your connection and they this person wants to be in a relationship with you they want marriage with you they want they want to tie you down here okay they want to settle with you could be a fire sign here this is fire energy so someone is taking the action to be closer to you okay they're trying to set up dates to see you they're trying to get you in a relationship they're trying to get you to do certain things to show them that you're committed to them this is their main focus all they're thinking about is commitment 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 that's very important to them that's that overall energy okay knight of uh, knight of cups this person is falling in love okay they've reached a high point with you but there's something that worries them now, Cancer, you've come up here as the chariot underneath. Um, we do have Scorpio. Mm. So I'm wondering what this is. Oftentimes, the Knight of Chalices, because he rules the seas, this can be Pisces here. So maybe this is the Pisces falling in love. Either way, that last card, sort of that outcome card, um, they have the chariot, you have the Knight of Swords. But both go into each other different approaches one's more cautious i feel like your person is um more cautious around you okay they're going to put their guard up because of something that you've done you're going to want to head straight into things but they'll put their guard up um they're going to try to protect themselves that's very important for them because that five of pentacles they're drained or exhausted about something that keeps happening they feel neglected by you in some way i don't know if it's sneaky behavior we've got the serpent this is something you've you've done before or you keep doing water signs. It's like you can't help it. Don't know if it's an addiction, a habit. It's something toxic uh, and it leaves this person with the seven of cups. It makes them feel like they don't know how they feel about you anymore. It's almost like they're dealing with someone completely different and they don't really know what's going on here. So the, the more and more you do it, the more and more like exhausted this person gets, the more and more it eats away at them. Again, it's hard to say. But I think, you know, subconsciously, they are still hopeful. Can, can you guys see that? It's so dark. Um, they are quite hopeful that you do have that four of wands. But I'm, I'm picking up that energy that they want the four. But this, you need to, they feel like maybe this is them. Okay, if they've done something sneaky, they feel like they need to shed some layers. Okay, there's something that they need to change. You might have wanted wanted to see a change in them, water signs, and they're shedding those layers. Snakes are about um, shedding those layers. So I wonder if there's something that they're going to do about themselves that maybe you've had an issue with before. Uh, maybe they don't spend enough time with you. Maybe they pressured you to do things. Maybe they were overly anxious. Um, maybe they were like more promiscuous. Whatever it was that you disliked about them, it could show that they want to make those changes here. Um, or they're going to try to at least shed some of those layers. I will leave it there, Water Signs. Thank you for tuning in, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Much love to you all, and until next time, bye for now.